Welcome to the tip of the day. I'm Jen Anthony for CPI. Today's tip, the first call is the turning point. You won't find the question on a customer satisfaction index survey. Who made the first phone call during your service visit? You or your service advisor? But the results would probably tell a story very much in line with the overall CSI score. If the customer responded that the service advisor made first contact during the service visit, the CSI score is likely to be above average. If the opposite is true, that the customer had to call first, you'd probably see that the CSI score on that survey tanked. The initial repair order write-up set the tone for the visit. A friendly personal greeting combined with an interactive walk around with the customer sets the stage for an excellent service visit. The turning point comes a couple hours later when the first call is expected. Make the first call, always. Think of it from a customer's mindset. The moment they place a phone call to you, you're late. At that point, they've already been thinking about their car's status for a while, waiting for an update from you. They've gone from curious to concerned to irritated, all before they pick up the handset and dial your number. What if nothing has happened? Regardless of the circumstance, the customer wants to be informed. The car hasn't gone in yet. At least the customer isn't worried about their hourly diagnostic charges are racking up. They may be a little irritated, but they're informed. The wheel alignment is taking forever. Perhaps the customer is happy to know it's being done right and is satisfied to be patient for the best results. A long estimate is coming? Call the customer and mention that it won't be much longer until you have more information. But your calling now is promised. And that's the tip of the day. The first call can make or break the service visit for CSI scores. It takes planning and discipline to adhere to a calling schedule, but it pays dividends in satisfied customers. Thanks for watching.